Howdy, it's Mars Legend. Welcome back to our Sacred Gold Egg Lock. In the last episode, we ended up taking on, uh, what's his name? Blaine. We took on Blaine, so that's pretty cool. In this episode, we're going to be getting the last couple encounters of this game and taking on the final canto gym leader, Blue, in Viridian City. So, pretty cool stuff. I'll go over the team here. As you saw, we had a grinding montage because I wanted to bring a new team along. And boom, here is the squad we're rocking with. Everyone's up to level 66. So, uh, I... There's only one little change since the end of the last episode when I announced when I put together the team. Anyways, first up we here we have Ernest the Charizard here with the docile nature holding the lucky egg with Fly Flint, the Crunch, and Earthquake. Next up we have Gray the Vapor in here holding leftovers of Grass Knight, Yawn, Ice Beam, and Surf. Uh, I need to get rid of his lucky egg actually. I need to give him the expert bell back. Did I go over its moves? Grass Knight, Yawn, Ice Beam, and Surf. Pretty cool stuff, modest nature. Next up, we have Marty, the uh, the giraffe rig, who ended up joining the squad last episode, and is an amazing Pokemon, and I love it a lot. This thing has the wise glasses, which boosts all special moves, with psychic energy while shockwave and nasty plot. Next up, we have Venus, the Carnivine, which is the first time I've ever used a Carnivine, so that is pretty cool. Like, not even in competitive, I never used one. It's got a timid nature, which kind of sucks, because this thing is a physical attacker with sleep powder crunch, poison fang, and seed bomb. It's also dark type, so that's pretty cool. Next up, we have Tiki, the uh, the Toxic Rook. So the reason I wanted to name it that is because I have a buddy uh, named who goes by Toxic Tiki. And I was thinking about that Toxic Croak and Takra. I didn't really like that name that much, so I just said we're gonna go with Tiki because it's a better name. So, anyways, pretty cool stuff. Uh, he's got an adamantation. This thing is a um, uh, hits super damn hard. We have Drain Punch, Sucker Punch, Bull Punch, and Poison Jab. If I can get a better Dark type move to replace Sucker Punch, because obviously the Pokemon, uh, after the uh, opponent has to attack me for Sucker Punch to work. So, anyways, pretty cool stuff. And then finally, we have Power the Flying On Channel Mascot, holding that Choice Band because of history with Crunch, Dragon Claw, Earthquake, and Strength. So this thing is a very cool Pokemon. I love it. Anyway, so something we're gonna check out today. I'm going to put Gray back in front because I'm going to need him today. Uh, specifically for who we're gonna go after first now uh, we did the whole event and we got him to where it is now the Suicune we're gonna go get Suicune kind of spoiled it I didn't want to if you played heart gold then you or heart gold or soul silver you'll know exactly what I'm talking about soul silver anyway this is where Suicune's final place is so we're gonna meet using I think in a sec I am no master here, as I predicted. Go ahead. Send the man your burn tower echo to say I found another Suicune with two of you. If you take a look, Suicune was waiting for you. It's been waiting for a battle with the Wizzy Trainer whom again trust itself. Yes. Uh, it arrived... When did it arrive, actually? What, what episode was it where we met Yuzine down, uh, and we... Did we battle him again? We found him right at Future City. So anyways, we're gonna get started here. It's also like one of my favorite themes of all time. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I suppose it doesn't matter. Venus has sleep powder. I wanted to check and see if this thing had sleep powder. The whole point is I wanted to stay in Gray, because Gray can ice beam this thing. And it, and it will for sure survive. Oh, uh, let's go for Eon. My ice beam, don't die. And it died. I mean, it doesn't really matter how many times I retry catching Suicune. It's literally gonna basically be the same each time. I, I'm, no, no. I mean, okay, this time it'll live another. What? That's definitely not correct. I ha held Control Three, and I don't know why. All right, let's try a Quick Ball this time. Cause I mean, the the point is that literally nothing we're gonna be hatching in this episode uh, is gonna be used because I'm gonna be bringing the squad I have right now to the uh, Elite Four. From that amount of HP, it looks like it should live... I'm gonna go for a Yawn here, and I'm gonna save state. Um, we'll save third state. I'm going to Ice Beam you again. Yes, this time you lived. Okay, thank you. Jeez, um, obviously I had to wrestle with the, uh, the IVs there. Anyway, I don't really know what exact... I'm gonna go for a Netball. Nope, not even close. Will you stop and just stay in the damn ball? Man! Hey, almost got it. I remember the last time I caught Suicune here, actually I caught it in a Pokeball. Playing with my buddy. We were, we were, he was playing, I think he had Heart Gold, and I had, uh, 
I had Soul Silver, and we I didn't know how to get Suicune actually. So he he knew how to do it, and he was at my house, and he showed me how to do it, and he and he was going at it a long time for a Pokeball, and I'm like, you're never gonna get it in a Pokeball, but he ended up catching it in a Pokeball. I think that's all he had, as far as I remember. He had like five Great Balls and then a bunch of Pokeballs. So just stay in the ball, damn it. I'm literally not going to go for the Master Ball. I want to use that on Latias or Raikou. We'll see what we do. Yay! Woo! We got him! Let's go. Alright, we're going to name you Azura in honor of the Soul Link because I had a Suicune that was absolutely amazing in our Golden, not Golden Silver, uh, Emerald Soul Link. It was paired with a Shiny Dragonite. Was it? Yeah. Yes, yes it was. I'm pretty... I, I'm... It was paired with a dragon type. It may have been, uh, a Salamence, actually. You two, Valkyam, you two are truly amazing. I know nothing about this intense. I have no regrets. Farewell, sweet girl. I'm gonna return to my hometown. Let's like, see you again. I don't remember where his hometown is. I think it's, like, Mahogany Town or something like that. Anyway, I don't care. We're gonna go back to the Pokemon Center. I'm... I should have gone to Pewter, but, you know... Anyway, Steven wants us to bring the Eon Pokemon. I'm literally just going to chase it down and chuck the Master Ball at it because I don't uh, really care too much about trying to actually, like, w waste a lot of time to catch it. So, it's going to be a little bit. la di it's just up here, damn it. I don't understand how the patterns work because it's a specific reason why... It's now over at Cerulean City when I was just at Cerulean City. Man, I hate this. See, it's like in both Cerulean and Celadon, it's always at the west part of this region. And it won't move anywhere else. Alright, let's see if Latias will stay where it is. It's literally south... Yeah, it's north of Saffron City, so it may stay there. Thank you. Please don't have changed. Forgot. You have to go through Cerulean City to get to the grass. Fuck. Okay, he stayed on the route. Or she, excuse me, because Latias is the girl. Okay. Damn it, I don't have cut. Okay, I'm going to have to go rebuy Earthquake for somebody. Probably Charizard. Actually, that could be decent for our Carnivine, but no. Nah, I'm just going to get rid of Earthquake and reteach it. There we go. You're only level 35? Holy cow. Didn't expect that. I don't want you fleeing, so we're just going to catch you and be done. Hey, Sigma. Okay, I'm going to fly to Pewter now, because we're going to have to go that way anyway. I feel that's probably better than the surfing routes. We may be able to get a, an encounter north of, uh, what's its... What do you call it? Cinnabar. But I'm going to be hatching a crap ton of eggs, so I'm probably... I might speed it up. You're an adamant... Adamant's not very good, though. Anyway, you're mild. Mild's a pretty deep... Well, it's not really. It's not that great. Uh, Rash would have been better, because this thing's is so defense-heavy. Anyway. And I'm pretty sure Steven is literally just going to give us the... Alright, what are you going to give me? Another yellow flower. But I'm pretty sure Steven is going to give me the... Soldu? Because that's what the Eon Pokemon like. Or what they hold. It's not as overpowered now as it was back... Here it is. Oh, it makes sense this is us. Asuki, I see you found the, si the place I said it was staying in. Did you find any trace Eon? I have it right behind me. I have Pokemon are following you. That definitely appears to be Latias, hmm? Stone I excavated seems to be reacting. Perhaps you should take it and check by an expert. Some in the may be fit for the job. Oh, the Enigma Stone. What? I thought that was gonna be the... Okay, it is the soul, dude. It's just, like, covered in crap. Okay. I'll fall. I'll keep Sigma in my party, just in case. Oh, you help me out. Okay. Was it the other with the golden Enigma Stone? Can it be take a look at it? Sure. Yes, thank you. It's quite interesting. Let's go into it. Let me give it a polish. Soul do, I'm pretty sure. Things the legendary soul do, yeah. Can they the spirit of the eon? You should keep it. I also don't know what I do with the red chain, because I feel like I'm supposed to give that to Cynthia. Aren't I? We're gonna give this to Sigma because I have no use for it otherwise. So I'm pretty sure I have to get all three of the 
Reggie's for Cynthia to look into the whatever the other thing I have is the red chain I wonder what kind of events Jayano put in that's something I'm interested to check out um, if you'd like me to record uh, when I do that definitely let me know and I'd be uh, glad to do that because it seems really dope I don't really need to battle anyone because I think I'm over leveled as it is and I don't know what levels the Elite Four rematches are at. Because I know Red's at like level 80, so I'm going to have to train up for that. Oh, this is Route 21. Okay, I'm glad I had a rappel on because I forgot. Uh, we'll just, we'll get this encounter to Tangela. Really? You didn't stay in that? I'm taking way too many risks. Oh, uh, will you stay in the ball, please? Okay, thanks. And a level 10 Meryl. Why are they so low leveled here? It's not like I could get here early in the game. What's up, Professor Oak? Ah, Zalkim, it's good of you to come all this way to Kanto. What do you think of the trainers? Pretty tough, huh? Oak, you're collecting gym badges. Man, that's hard. This shooting is exactly when you get them all. I have a gift for you. Keep it up. How's your Pokedex coming along? It doesn't matter. I mean, in the original games, he gave you the Kanto starters. Hi, Red's been away isn't call. I have no idea where he is, but he's been doing. Say no, this is good news, but I do worry about him. Well, I mean, who wouldn't? Hi, my kid brother is a leader in Virginia City. He goes out of town and causes problems for the trainers. Okay, well, I already... He's preparing to beat... To battle me, not beat me. I'm gonna kick his ass, but... You know. Anyway. Route 1. Oh, man, the memories. Kind of funny, like, how do trainers... New Pallet Town trainers, I guess there's only two, able, are able to do anything. I'm gonna avoid battles. I legitimately don't need to, and I'm gonna save them for when... We need to grind. To take on red, I'm gonna have to grind a lot. It's gonna be no simple feat to fight him, especially how high how high how leveled. Wow. I'm gonna need to stock up on items too. This might be the long episode that I promised last time would be. Anyway, let's get us an, an encounter in this water. Mainly I just don't feel like fishing. It's a bullwag. I don't know if he gives me anything important. I think it's sleep talk. I must have ones up. We are drowsy. What's this? Where did this team come from? 85. What is that? Dream meter. Oh. Okay. I don't know if there's anything really to do in Viridian besides take on the gym leader. Do you put a lot of thought into naming your Pokemon, giving it good, good nicknames? I often na I name them after people who commented on the episodes and then personal nicknames for Pokemon that I have. Alright, Route 22. Have I got an encounter on Route 22? I don't believe so. Because I, I wasn't on this side of Victory Road. Sephiro. Wow. That thing did not want to stay in the ball. I don't know if Surf will kill, and if it does, oh well. It's not like I really need any more encounters anyway. I'm literally going to be hatching all the eggs. I think I want to hash them in this episode. Because as I said, it doesn't matter what I get because they, I'm not keeping any of them. Alright, let's go up to... Damn it. I don't think I could have avoided you, actually. Okay, sweet. Next up is a pincer. Simpler to make sure you don't die. I don't want my Vaporeon to die at this point, especially. Shall we train phone numbers? Sure, it doesn't matter to me. I won't be using this game for... I won't be using this cartridge. I, it's not... A... Is it a cartridge? It's... I don't know. Who cares? Is all cam Professor Oaks waiting? Sacred Ash. Great, because that's something useful. I mean, it's it's not that it's not useful, I just don't need it. Alright, now time to go into the Radiant Fortis. Fortis? Oh my gosh, dude. Um, I think we should be good enough, because there's an actual, there's another event in here. I have to literally be... Oh my gosh, can you screw up? What it goes just like Bug Bug One? I don't know, I don't care! Okay, thank you. I was kind of worried you'd explode. I guess I got a battle blue. I don't think I can do anything until I battle blue. But I want to go into the Viridian Forest. There's an encounter we get, and then there's an also a specific event. With a Pokemon that I really like. Uh, let's just say he's been on the Kansas City New Kings twice. There's your hint. I like this gym. The Yolo's in Megan Floor is unstable. Great, I know. He's not a pushover. Of course he's not. That would just be too easy. I think the only way to progress is to battle him. 
Never mind, I wasn't paying attention there. Sweet, I can get through without battling anybody. I actually really love this gym though, it's very colorful. I love the colors. There we go. Should bring me there. And this one will bring me here. Nice. Yeah, I go this way. And I'll get there, and then it's one of these forward. Otherwise, it's a double battle. No! That's what it is. Okay. And if I fail, it brings me to him. No biggie. Alright, I'm really glad I didn't battle too many trainers, because we're right on target. Ow! Bye-bye. Sorry, Flygon. Power, lo power look-alike. Okay, it's this one here. Alright, Blue. This is gonna be one hell of a battle, for sure. Yo, finally got here! <laughs> I was in the mood at Cinnabar, but now I'm ready to battle you. You're not telling me you conquered all gyms? Ha! <laughs> Joe's gyms are that pathetic? Don't worry about it. I'll know if you're good enough at battling right now. Carnivine and Gray are gonna be very helpful in this match, I believe. We know with a Nita Queen. If I can send in Toxicroak safely on something later, then I, I can get rid of those spikes. You're gonna send an Executor. Oh yeah, that's right, you don't use... Yeah, you're different. I forgot. You're in a Leaf Storm. Man, I was scared to go into a uh, Toxic Rook. Next up is a Machium. You can't do much to me. Well, we'll let Tiki come out here and absorb the Toxic Spikes. Um, I can Poison Jab you. That'll be my best move. Actually, don't Poison. Fire Punch. Okay. Thinking about it, I'm gonna go for Drain Punch, because if I... Uh, if I poison that thing, that could be really bad. Alright, let's go Marty. Uh, I should be faster. Yeah, that should hurt. If not, Aqua Chip. Ow. Alright. Sweet! He's been, he hasn't been a pushover, but it's not been a very difficult fight so far. Oh my gosh, this ace is a T-Tar? I wasn't actually checking if the, it had seals. It, all the aces have seals. At least the Kanto aces do. Bandit Earthquake should do a lot. Oh my gosh, it O code! How are you are a monster? Needle Queen. Okay, we're gonna go back into you. You know what? I'll stay in! I'll stay in! Power can handle this. Of course he can. Bandit Earthquake and a crit just to rub it in. It's like double overkill. Alright, I don't even know what Rhyperior can do. Yeah, Tyranitar is his ace. Here I'm prepared, we'll knock you down. I'm unprepared. I have most of my team is good against the entirety of yours. Charizard could have been used against Executor, but why not use the new blood? There we go. Wrecked, I wasn't even paying attention to what he said there. We did it! This is the real power of Johto! Yeah, you're damn right. I already beat the Elite Four, bro. No way. How the heck did I lose to you? <laughs> All right, take this. It's the Earth Badge. We got the last badge in this game. I kind of messed it up. I was trying to, I kind of combined Earth Badge and I didn't want to say Earth Badge. I wanted to say the last badge. But with this badge, you'll be able to use Rock Climb. Here, take this as well. 92. Is that Trick Room? Yep, it contains Trick Room. It allows slower Pokemon to move forward faster. It's very tricky, hence the name. Pop up Triumph over here is my phone number. He should give you, like, Earthquake. Because obviously that's, like, one of. Oh! Breaststroke gave me a call. Ah, this Breaststroke, you don't have to say anything. I know better than anyone else how hard you've been working. I should get you a present and someone appreciates you. Well, I picked it up. I completely forgot to give it to you. <laughs> you don't have to worry. Wonder, it's something that will be very helpful. You should just come here and pick it up. We're waiting for you in my laboratory in Pallet Town. Sorry if you hear thumping upstairs. I think someone's playing with. One of the dogs are watching. <laughs> ah, good to see you. It's just I wanted to give to you. Oh, Rock Climb. That's what you gave me. Okay. 
that here machine get named Zorkland, me teacher, can go up rock walls that have steps carved into them. Those badges are why you've not only become Johto, but you've collected all the Kanto badges. Well done. No more than someone you will tell you what. Make your agency can go to Mount Silver. Mount Silver is a big mountain home to many wild Pokemon. So you didn't have a string of suits, I'm limits, but we make an exception in your case. Yeah, might want to check out Viridian Forest. Okay. That makes a sense. We're gonna go to Viridian Forest first. You have Earth Badge, you can go through Pokemon have gotten really rough. I like the baseline in this track. Okay. Anyway, it's a gloom. Holy crap, that's a high level. That was on accident. We're just gonna re-encounter. Doesn't really matter. As I already said, I'm most likely not gonna use. I was trying to switch in earnest because he had a fire type or a grass type, and I did not want to have my Vaporeon take extra damage. Okay. Let's crunch. I should yeah. Can you not? Ernest, can you literally stop? Thank you. Okay, I don't have any more net balls. I use them all. I'm pretty sure this thing's a, a bug type. Let's go for another net. Stay. Oh, well, you're not that much lower level than me. That yeah, that makes sense. Will you stop? Just get in the ball, bro. Thank you. I don't know why it stayed in the lure ball of everything. I didn't mean to do that. We're gonna encounter a, a very special Pokemon. And there she- and there is Mr. Oh, that's a ledge. I didn't even see that. What do, what do you- what did I call you? I know what I called you. I called you Hazel. I don't remember what I called you in Season 1 of the DBL. That's a level 48 Weeping Bell! S 68, excuse me. It's crazy. What is this? A Leaf Stone. Mew. So basically, it's just a, a fetch quest. Alright, since this is an Ariados, I'll attack it. I want to get Grey leveled up, because why not? Alright, Power wants to give me whatever he has. He has a stump! <laughs> I may go and dress up one of our Pokemon. Uh, just for that. Psych up. Okay. I mean, I once again, I don't want to battle these trainers if I don't have to. No place for the likes of children. Ah, oh, screw off! Holy Kaya! Maybe you were joking! Holy crap! Guy, that, that was a tough fight. And just because I have it, I'm gonna use a Sacred Ash. Doesn't really bother me, because it's the last actual episode, and this is the team I already mentioned, this is the team I'm bringing with me to Elite Four, so... They're sticking around. Oh my gosh, bro, there's so many people. Now, I really wish that I... I didn't even have to fight him, actually. I could have just avoided him, and not have had that happen but anyways power levels up to 67 i'm gonna switch him out but this will be a great place to train because these pokemon are so high level oh there you are Mew. i'm pretty sure this is where Mew goes or something so is it now at the beginning of the forest or something what the heck Mew, would you go oh Mew. Mew. I think I have enough Pokeballs to throw at it. Whew! Whew! I don't want to fight. You got these Pokemon are way too damn strong. Okay, let's put not Tiki out front. Let's go for Venus. So we'll save right here, because Venus is, uh, Sleep Powder. I don't even know what level this thing is. It's 45! Beat up. Lol. Why did you have a Lumberry? Okay, that didn't kill. One more. And since you're asleep, you won't get poison. Okay, let's go for a love ball. Because this will fit you perfectly, Mew. Now, I should have thrown a quick ball. You know what? I'm gonna try Control R. Or I'm gonna reset. And just... Toss a quick ball first. I doubt it'll catch it, but... Never hurts to try. Yeah. I don't even know what I got... With metronome, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, I was meant to go for Seed Bomb, because I know it won't kill with the defense race. Beautiful. Perfect amount of health. Now, you want to get in the... That's not the love ball. That's the level ball. But the level ball should do decently, because of the difference in our levels. I don't know exactly how it works. Mew wanted to be in the party, or Mew's got a good catch rate. I have no clue. Beautiful! 
All right, Hazel. Sorry, I can't use you because that's against my rules. I already it wasn't. I I would rather use the giraffe rig anyway because it's not uh, a very commonly used Pokemon. All right. That is. Uh, I'll be back. Hey, Ernest Grid Level 67. Alrighty, holy crap, we have a lot of encounters. <laughs> Look how many we had left to get. That's crazy. I should have gotten the. Um, the. I should have gone to all the way. Damn it, man. All the way to Pallet Town. Uh, in the last episode. So I would have had more encounters that episode rather than. This, but. Man, that's eight Pokemon. Crazy! And I didn't do any organizing from after the last hatching session, so we still have a bunch of random Pokemon. So we're gonna go, we're gonna start at box A. I gotta pull up my number generator. All right, the first one is egg number 10. I think we hatched a 10 last time. And leftovers, of course it is. I didn't exchange any of my Pokemon. All right, we'll try that again. This leftovers holding Pokemon in place of our level 40 Suicune. I suppose it really doesn't matter. I suppose we can just see what we would get, though. Alright, next up, we've got Egg 29. And then 4. Solvernia. 23 was the next egg. And then finally, we'll just do one in here, because... Why not? We get Egg 9. There's no item on them I need, so I'm just gonna hatch. Alright, horn. That's another one. So what I'm legit gonna do is I'm going to be getting our encounters, so non-duplicate Pokemon. And then... Um... I'll just... I'm literally gonna hatch the rest of the eggs, as I mentioned already. A Remoraid. A Ralt. A Thorchick. Alright, I'm just gonna do the... the like, the tactic of where I just... Go around the box and exchange which over... Which egg I'm over. That didn't work. Alright, that works. Got a lucky egg. I mean, it makes sense. I was kind of lucky with that. <laughs> Alright. Box 9. Number 2. Your name is Goober. And the Solvernia was the Ralts. Alright, there we go. Your name is Goober. I actually really wonder what that would be. Okay. The box is full. I don't know what box I tried to put it in. I kept my eyes open for that, but I wasn't even paying attention. I don't know any of the egg. I don't know. Oh, I went to the wrong box. We're going to exchange a box from an egg from this box, because why not? Well, oh my gosh, man. This is frustrating. What do you want, Brock? Didn't mean to do that. I actually meant to see what Brock wanted. A sneasel. Have we actually got one this LP? I don't even remember hatching one. A gable. Another gable. Okay, what's next? Uh... Tyro. This is bagel. I'm gonna keep the sneasel because I don't remember hatching one. And the rest of them are gonna go and be exchanged again. I guess Dreano gave Sneasel Technician in this game. That's pretty cool. Another Eevee. I never thought I'd be hatching a dupes Carnivine. I'm gonna I'm be honest. It's an Aeron. Bet you're Doomize. No, you're not. Yeah, neither of those wanted to hatch. Okay. What are the next two? Hey, I bet Ryalu's not even Demise. What is that? I'm excited. It's just a hound hour. I'm not gonna lie, I actually got confused which carnivine was mine. It's a totodile. That is dope. Nice. That is the highest level so far. Uh, it'll be level 54. That's the first time we patched the one, I'm pretty sure. I ended up grabbing a uh, uh, three duck, which I didn't realize. <laughs> which is obviously gonna be a Porygon. Yep. Ooh. Another Eevee. Okay, I want to hatch this egg named The Power with a Silk Scarf. I have no clue what that would be. Because why would you give a flag on a Silk Scarf, huh? Exactly. But obviously this wasn't made for me. 
You know what? Oh, no, that's why it was named The Power. I remember Shady used th this Bidoof in his playthrough. I was wondering, I'm like, uh, well, hmm, if he... How, how would he have the power after the power, which makes sense, but that is Bidoof. Seen that queen. Not easy. Yay. You know, I don't even know if I have him in order at this point, but this is the last extra egg. As well as I could have. That's a, that's dope. Larvitar. I don't believe we've got a Swablu. The Larvitar was the one holding the Master Ball. So that was kind of interesting. Anyways, this was, last egg doesn't want to hatch quickly. Great. All right, random, more random eggs. Aeron. Another Aeron. A Rhyhorn. How crazy is that that we hatched, I don't know, very similar Pokemon. And so that first egg is named Rosalina. My guess is that is going to be a Gardevoir. And I believe that was Rosalina. Yeah. A Heracross! That's pretty cool. I don't believe we've gotten one of those. And a Mudkip! Dude, why is it now we're getting all the non-dupes Pokemon? It's a fan pee. That one was shining because it was light. Light colored. A Chinchu. We've already gotten one. A Drowsy. That's cool. I don't know if we've gotten one, but I'm just going to count it. Alright, well those are all the new Pokemon we've got. That took a long ass time, bro. And I let freaking a bot a whole box die and I we still have so many. I was done hatching more eggs. So we're literally gonna go catch Raikou. Because I got another Master Ball. So we're gonna go do that and exchange it literally just for GP. Good day to you, Zokim. It's been a while since we met. Have you heard of Pokemon no Joachi? You say capable to go and just walk over Samba. Do so much here, Sound of Purity. Look at me, you said the rest in deep cabins. I couldn't say where. Am I telling you this? Your Pokemon goes up with somebody, Joachi may be re present. We can't do anything more suitable. Okay, I'm not going after Jirachi. There's a lot of shit to do, though. So, this is a really cool thing that Drano has done. There we go. Look how low I got it and asleep. But we're just gonna use a Master Ball, because we got one. Think about it, we would have actually had one more. Had I not surfed the fear I would see if it would kill. West. Oh, really? I thought it was East. Okay. I, I could be wrong, I thought it was East in the original games. What route is this? I don't care. I'm not catching a Pokemon here, even this is a new route. Yeah, this is Route 28. It's a brand new route. I'll check the quick, I'll check a quick, you know, I'm actually going to check the quick, alright, I caught the ponytail, I'll exchange it because screw it, who cares. And if you have a problem with it, then that's just too bad. There we go. Alright, this counts as Mount Silver, so I don't have to go all the way up to the mountain right now. Hey! I'm not even going, I'm literally not going to write down, um, where they're what their levels are or anything, because I don't care. It's a Hound Hour. Oh, one of them's named Tails. I'm guessing that's going to be a Volpix. Surprise it doesn't have a Firestone. That is a Horsey, and that's the top one, right? Yep. Alright, what's Tails going to be? It's a Buizel! Oh, that is awesome. Shiny Buizel. That's a really good name for it, actually. I don't need to write it down. I know I've not gotten a Buizel. Another Hound Hour. What the heck? What are the chances, bro? This guy's got a black belt. I think it's a Tyrogue. I want to, I want to pick up this a cold Huffin Puff. That seems interesting. It's a Machop. Nope, that is way better. That is a Pokemon I have not gotten yet. And a Hoppip! Shiny Hoppip's ugly. There we go. Those, those are literally all of the encounters in the game. I think the actual mountain part of Mount Silver might have its own... In, uh, whatever, but... That's awesome. We got some very cool Pokemon to finish this out. I don't know why I'm doing this, because I'm literally going to put you guys back down. And... Start hatching. So... 
See you on the flip side. Everybody wants to be a master. Everybody wants to show their skills. Everybody wants to get there faster. Make their way to the top of the hill. Each time you try, gonna get just a little bit better. Each step you climb, it's one more step up the ladder. It's a Everybody needs to carve their mark To stand alone in the victory circle State the claim when the music starts Give it all you got You can be the very best ever Take your best shot What you've learned will come together It's a whole new world we live in It's a whole new way to see It's a whole new place With a brand new attitude But you still gotta catch up that you can be a fucking macho I guess that's a perfect way to end is the Delibird. Uh, it's kind of funny though how uh, it all ended up perfectly. I had the perfect amount of eggs that ended up being a set number of a uh, whole whatever or anything. Anyways, Delibird is the last Pokemon we had, so pretty cool stuff. We got some interesting Pokemon. There's a lot of Pokemon that uh, we did not get the chance to use in whatever but look at all of these guys just so many mons there's so many like really cool ones that i wish i had hatched such as like you know there's a core fish there is a i don't remember what else we got there was a bunch of cool stuff i wish we'd have gotten but that is it guys those are all the eggs in the next episode we will be taking on the elite four rematches i believe and red will be the episode after so I'm a bit, definitely a bit nervous, so I really hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, I like, appreciate it. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. I'll talk to you all later.